59th victory in total. It looked like dominance, but that was not an easy race today. No, it was, uh, it was quite a difficult one because we were on the medium initially, and uh, of course, Fernando was on the hard tire, so we didn't want to go that long, but we had to, to stay out. The rain was coming, so we didn't know really what was going on. And uh, yeah, the tires were graining, and then um, took a few laps to get through that graining phase, and then the pace picked up a, a little bit, but it was still very tricky to drive. Then it started to rain lap by lap, a bit more, a bit more. So at one point, of course, we had to make the call to go into the interest. But yeah, it was incredibly slippery. When you are that far in the lead, you don't want to push too hard, but also you don't want to lose too much time. So it's quite a, quite difficult, you know, in that in that scenario. Um, clipped the walls a few times, but it was super difficult out there. But yeah, that's Monaco. That is Monaco indeed. Well, you see, you clipped the wall. It looked like you were trying to run run down the barrier between Port A1 and Port A2 before entering the tunnel. That must have been a heart in the mouth moment. Yeah, I um, I locked the rears and I couldn't get out of it, so I was just <laughs> trying to control it with a bit of drifting. But uh, luckily, the wall in a way stopped it from sliding even more, of course. How important is this victory here in Monaco? We talk about it being the jewel in the crown of the Grand Prix season. Yeah, it's super nice to win it. It's also super nice to win it, I think, in the way we did today with the weather and everything, to stay calm and, uh, yeah, bring it home. And, uh, yeah, again, a lot of points for the team as well, so it's great. Father extending your lead in the World Championship. Yeah, exactly that. Yeah, excellent. Maxwell, go and enjoy the podium ceremony. And as he wanders...